When your soil is so good, your garden is literally bursting at the seams. In truth though, nothing lasts forever. Even the best designs can fall victim to time. Or in this case, an errant lawnmower. I nicked this eight by two bed as I was passing by cutting the grass and totally blew the corner apart. I didn't just leave it though. I clamped it and put a couple of screws in thinking I had fixed it. But even the cinching pull force of three inch deck screws isn't enough for soil and plant roots, unfortunately. Hi, I'm Jeff from the Ripe Tomato Farms. Welcome to another episode of The Garden Quickie, the show where in two minutes or less, we tackle all your gardening problems head on. In this case, garden bed repair. This is actually a bigger job than it looks. Time's short, so let's get going. The first thing we have to do is dig out a portion of the soil. There's no way we're ever gonna get this bed square and back together with hundreds of pounds of soil in the way. Okay, now that we can see what we're working with, let's measure the two damaged sides and see what we're in for for lumber. Measure twice, cut once. For corner repair on raised beds, it's almost always easiest to just build a new L shape and insert it inside. That's what I'm gonna do here. I'm gonna use solid two by fours all the way. I could use plywood, but I just don't feel comfortable with all the glues they use to make it. Not for a food producing bed. All right, with the boards all cut, I'll pre-assemble the insert to make it easier. Seems pretty solid. This should work out great. I'll go ahead and clamp the bed so it's perfectly square. Time for the insert. This thing fits like a glove. Square off the corners, screw it into place, and we're done. All I gotta do now is add back in the soil and we're all done. Nothing beats fixing something yourself, using your own two hands and your own ingenuity. Nothing except maybe the next episode of the Garden Quickie. Thanks for watching guys. And hey, if Garden Quickies are your thing, be sure to click on this playlist here as we explore and solve more growing issues in two minutes or less.